is you can take your right hand and put it in front of your mask about five inches and kind of wave your hand back and forth a little bit in front of it about right here until you kind of see the shadow of your fingers and then you're just going to wave it. You start to see it once you start um, you start seeing through the mask. You go a little faster too if you want and you start catching it. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, it is cool. That's way cool. And um, now you're, you're going to focus your beam, which is your pineal gland, which is your intention um, towards the paper. So you can start um, aiming yourself towards the paper now. Okay. And you can position yourself in your mask and see if you can see your finger now downward. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like kind of work yourself down towards the paper. Mm hmm kind of circle right yep so yeah paper's right here and you can touch the paper so you can feel it okay. you're gonna find any circle in any color and uh and you will be able to feel the vibrations and the shape, and you can see which one it is. So you can just kind of move your finger along and, and see which one's which. Not even on a shape? Yeah, you're on a shape. And you can trace to see what shape it is. And you can, like, like when you were doing that drawing, you can feel the rigidness. Is that a triangle? Um, no, not a triangle. There's no triangles, right? Uh -huh. But but that was a square. You were doing it right with your okay. fingers. Oh, mm -hmm. cool. You thought that bottom layer goes straight, right? Yeah. Is that a circle? That is a circle. Cool. <laughs> is that cool? Yeah, that's pretty cool how you can see through the mask like that. Yeah, it is, like spiritually. <laughs> It's like oh, a faith realm. Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're, I'm going to take the card. And you're mm -hmm. going to have your blindfold on. I'm going to move it either up, down, left, or right. Mm -hmm. And then when I move it there, you're going to tell me what position it is, the number, and the suit. It can also be a king, jack, ace. So it's diamonds, hearts. Yep, um, yep ten of diamonds. Uh, and, it, and it went to the right. Okay. So in your mask, no, it makes you really go. I'm trying to think of what the suits are. Diamond, diamonds, heart. What's the other two suits? Um, oh yeah. So we got ace, king, queen, jack. Um, oh, space, what's this called clubs. again? I never play cards. Um, clubs. Clubs. Yeah, you could describe it then. Okay. Diamonds, clubs, spades, and hearts. Right. That's it. Okay. Diamonds, clubs, spades. And like you can even get it like this one here. I'm sensing it's a dark card. And oh, so it's okay. a black one. A lot of the students get all of them in a row, like boom, 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 like the position, the number of the cards by doing it, you know, for a day. Right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So you can put the blackboard on now then. So, so you me tell if it's what position I went. And what number it is and what suit yep. it is. I'll remind you of the, the suits. I'm taking the card, I'm moving it now. Flipping it now. And you can focus on one thing at a time. First the position, then the number, and then the suit. I got the top. Number four. Diamonds. Wow. <laughs> no way. Yeah. That's why I didn't get the heart part. Yeah, but you seen the red. Yeah. Uh, cool. Nequa? Yeah. How, how'd you get that inside? I heard it. So I got it now and I'm just going to place it right here. And you mm -hmm. can grab it and do whatever you want with it. Wait, let me tell you. Anything I feel about it? Yeah, anything you feel about it, see about it, hear about it, sense about it. It could be spiritual taste, spiritual smell, spiritual eyes. You can um, tap it on your mask, move it around, whatever you want to do. Anything. You can literally eat it. Is it a donut? No. <laughs> you 
you tap it on your pineal gland, you may see a color. I see red. Good job, it is red. That's the keys for me. <laughs> okay. On it. I, I thought it was a red tomato, but it was a red apple. Wow. I got close. Wow. I, I saw it. That's impressive, isn't it? Yeah. It's pretty cool. But it looks like a tomato. That's really good. Okay, I have, so I have a, a little object in my hand, and I'm going to um, move this out of the way. An and, object? Um, like what? And um, I have a, a little object, a specific one. On your hand? Um, and uh, no, no, it's on. It's in in front of you somewhere on the mat. And uh, I want you to ele electromagnetically find it without touching the mat, but hover right above it with your finger. Oh, okay. Move this. Right there? Nope. Right there? And whenever you feel confident, you can go for it. Is that what it was? Yeah. I felt tingling in my hand. Oh, wow. That's a button. Yeah. <laughs> that's really good. First time I was just guessing, but the second time I felt tingling. Now I want you to do a word of knowledge on me, and uh, I'll do some on you, and, and this is how um, I'll do it. So you can um, basically just like that. And this is called countenance word of knowledge. So uh, what, what I do is I'm going to show you some on you real quick. So I'm going to look into, look into your eyes, but I do it like this. So look into your eyes, boom, I remember your eyes, and I remember the countenance around your eyes. And um, just by doing that, I've seen there was something with, uh, like you like cats. Um, I was giving the basics on that. And again, you're really a big beach person, believe it or not. I mm -hmm. uh, see so you eating at like a cocoa beach on the pier, um, mm -hmm. eating some food over there. Some likings, and I can now I can start changing it up by having an intention of uh, what you ate today, what you drank today, or um, uh, what you watched on TV. Anything you can even ask me something like a specific question that you want me to see if I can get it. What to eat today? What to eat today? Okay, I've already seen something there. To describe it. I see like uh, some mashed up type of potatoes with like orange cheese on top. It's orange. Is that is that cheese? Orange cheese? Yeah. Um, I see it on top. Like shred, <laughs> shredded way. cheese, right? Shredded cheese? But it was like melted? No, it's not melted, but it is orange. Okay. It is melted. Yeah, kind of. Okay. It's saucy. And the other stuff was uh, on top, underneath that orange stuff. It's kind of like a whitish, yellowish, tannish. Like yeah. a, a potato type of thing. Oh, ravioli. Oh, ravioli. Go, go. The noodles yellow. <laughs> you got the colors right. Oh, yeah, the, the colors are right. Because I do the colors a lot. <laughs> 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 Let's see if I can get something else then. Um, so I'm looking at your face. Boom. And so what I did is I see your eyes. And I see your countenance in the background. But I mostly, mostly uh, focus on your eyes. So let's see if I can get a name of um, uh, a name of family members or something. Something recent. Conversation. Um, as soon as I even started thinking about that, I started getting like a. That's not the name. L. Linda. Not an aunt, Linda. I just came down to visit. Okay. Is that be it? Um, but it was two months ago. No, it was two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. Okay, two. And she drove down. Yeah. See if you can see where she's from. Okay, let's go. location I need to put a name on it to see. I'm getting a pro proximity around two hours and 45 minutes. About a three hour drive, two and a half hour drive. South. Yep, she's in Miami. Okay, about three hours away, right? Yeah, that's <laughs> good. Yeah, I was, see I was seeing the scenery, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to put a picture on it. 
That's really yeah, good. That wow. Is. How'd you do that? <laughs> um, I just... Uh, practicing? Uh, no, after your eyes. Really? So, so what I did was I remember your eyes. Like, I was also getting something. Um, you have a daughter, two daughters, one daughter? Two daughters. Two daughters. Yeah. So your Aunt Linda came down and spent some precious time with your, with your daughters and spent some time. Um, I'd see you, uh, like, in... Your daughters are eating cereal. You guys having a conversation in the living room, like watching the TV, things like that. But then when you asked me uh, where she was from, I remember your face. That's how I did it. But your face, I found out where she was from. Mm -hmm. So I, uh, I'm, I seen her bringing like some luggages out of the um, the car because she mm -hmm. stayed for a while, mm -hmm. and she stayed for about. It came about two weeks ago. She left about nine days ago, so she stayed about six or five days, something like that. About five days. Yeah, she stayed for four. Four days. Yeah. Cool. Um, I think I don't remember. Maybe it was five. Yeah. I can't remember. Okay. I don't know. So I'm assuming I did to remember that when you asked me where she was from, um, and I remember that she drove there. New South. That was good. Yes, yeah, South. And then I was getting about um two hours and forty-five minutes. Like you try me now. So what I do is I almost do like the snap thing or the three to one inside. It helps me with my brain and um, and it helps me connect. So I kind of look at you and go, boom, and I remember your eyes. And that's what I kind of focus on. And then in the background, I remember your countenance. What's countenance mean? Um, countenance is uh, everything but the eyes. Like in the Bible verse, uh, it says in Genesis, um, Cain, God says to Cain, why, is, why are, is your face downcast? If you do the right thing, you know, you know you'll be approved or happy. So he was like depressed, like a down face, down face. So countenance is like the appearance in the background um, of your face, like a happy countenance, sad countenance. Oh, okay. Yeah, expression. Oh, okay. That's the word for it. I remember your um, expression. Okay. Mm -hmm. so, so when you look into my eyes, you can also see the expression that's carrying behind the soul. Okay. So, I so, so you look into it, and then you can look away and remember. And then stay. You got it, yeah? Right. You remember the way my eyes looked, how I was looking at you? Yep. And now you can choose what you want for information or what you remember. You looked happy. Like, you're happy that things are starting to go right. True. Changing for the better. I know you brushed your teeth this morning. That's right. I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> That's true too. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. um, see, so see, actually, do that. Actually, with the brushing teeth thing, the reason it came to mind. Actually, see what I was doing while brushing my teeth. I saw you. Uh, see what you're doing while you're brushing your yep. teeth. So imagine my eyes, imagine my countenance, and then think about me brushing my teeth. And then, and then you're there, and I'll give it to you. Let's see. Um, I see you looking in the mirror, brushing your teeth. Okay. See that you. How you brush them? Fast? You brush your teeth fast? Uh, yeah, I was brushing my teeth fast because I had to get on the podcast and I was running out of time and I was saying, hold on, hold on. That's what I see, you brushing yeah. real fast. Yeah, I was. And, um, you guys and, are normal. And, and, and yeah, that's right. And I was also on the phone uh, with somebody and they're like, what? What are you saying? <laughs> I'm like, hold on. <laughs> so I was brushing my teeth fast. <laughs> And I had my other guy on the computer. I'm like, one second. And I was also on the phone. Oh, no. Yeah, that's all I saw you. Just that's like, right. Real quick. And you can also see the reason, too, if you wanted to do reason. It would, that would be revealed. You know? Okay. So that's how you do uh, the word knowledge as an example on the countenance type. Um, try try more and see. Um, you already seen what I ate. That was my breakfast. So yeah. Let's see. Um, how about. You can even do future meals. Future meals. I that as well. <laughs> I got real specific on it too. It was, it was something. But did you have six people on your Zoom call yesterday? Um, that's a good one. I think so. I can pull it up and look. I remember uh, Luke was on there. Verdale was on there. Oh yeah, George Jorge was on there. Alexa was on there. I was on there. Kane was on there. Boom, six. Yeah, <gasps> including me. I, I saw you at the <laughs> Zoom it. stream with the yeah, boxes. Actually, oh, cool. Yeah, wow. I actually got to pull up and show you that. There were six of us, Ooh. including myself. Yep. Yeah. Yep. That's good. Right. I'm doing good at Zoom. this. <laughs> six people on the Zoom call. <laughs> yep. That's good. Let's see what y'all talked about. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I just heard wife. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, first time I met Jorge and, and his wife. So he had a wife on there. 
Yeah. Yep. Jorge and his wife. Um, How would I know that? Usually two people don't go on Zoom calls together. Yeah, I know, exactly. They, they went out together. That's good. Let me see. Uh -huh. What else I can see about other Zoom calls? And this buddy, my buddy, says, uh, hey, is that your girlfriend? He goes, no, my wife. Then we got to know his wife. I'm her wife. Mm -hmm. Like, the wife was one of the topics. Yeah, yeah. She was asking all the questions, and uh, that's funny. It's on record and stuff. She was a big talker. And, yeah, like, and I was having conversations mm -hmm. with someone's wife. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Someone laughed. One of them laughed a lot, right? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Left and right. Okay. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, that's the truth. <laughs> Nothing about it. it was, the whole thing was like a joke. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. a bunch of laughing. Tons of it. We were cracking up laughing. Um, and another one, try now try this word of knowledge. Uh, so you see me, uh, without looking at the screen, um, so you see me uh, right here. Or you, or you see somebody in the midst of doing something. Like, I'll try to get a word of knowledge on me within uh, five seconds. Like, I'm going like this. I'm looking at something. Like you're reading people in their body language and what they're thinking in the moment to moment basis. Oh, okay. um, you know what I'm saying? So you want so, me to tell you what you're thinking? Um, or, or see if you get a word on, yeah, what are you picking up in these angles now? Um, on my body language and what I'm doing. So, um, okay. Like what, what can you read here? Even though I'm playing around, but you can do it more in a natural way. Oh, I guess I'm, as I'm talking to you, like right now, I'm getting a chair. What did you get out of that? What was prophetic about that? But you can do it in a word of knowledge. You can remember me doing that. Like when I watched your chair here, that would show signs of um, you know what I mean? Like I'm trying to do it. And like every 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 movement that I do, you can do those as well. Oh, okay. Training, or okay. Make sense? Yeah. Okay. So you're thinking about um, what you're gonna do later. Is that wrong? Um, <laughs> I um, pretty much about the uh, on some of the training here with uh, you and I. Oh, 